Six plus, eh? You want an extra bit of a challenge? Well, have a look just here. Now, for the first time ever, we are using the treble clef, which we've been using the whole time, which is anything above s middle C, which is this middle C just here. These Cs go down, these Cs all the way up. Middle C is like a little sort of like a, a separator between the treble, oh, excuse me, the treble clef and the bass clef. Now the bass clef, I'm going to talk about the treble and bass clef in a different lesson. So don't you worry about being able to read the bass clef. I just wanted to show you what happens with your left, because your left generally plays the bass and your right generally plays the treble. Treble being the high notes, bass being the low notes. So, here we go. Your right hand on this is exactly the same as challenge six. Chord six, two, three, four, chord four. Then it repeats. Now your left hand, your left hand does a very slightly different thing. Your left hand does not go up to the G. Your left hand goes down to the G. You see how I've gone this way here. So if you go eight, seven, six, five, seeing that is eight instead of one, eight, seven, six, five, there's that chord five there. You then go up to chord six and then down to chord four. So watch the left hand by itself. So with them put together, my thumb on middle C, my pinky on the C below that, an octave below, and then the fifth, one, two, three, four, five, first and fifth on the left, triad on the right. Remember it goes up on the right, but it goes down on the left. Here's challenge six plus. Good luck with this two-handed business. It can be a bit tricky, but don't you worry. Bit of practice, you got it sorted. One, two, to finish on the sea. Yeah! All right, should we do it a little bit faster this time? Let's see if you can keep up with me. Counting in. One, two, three, four. Challenge six plus complete. If you're doing that with two hands now, you're really playing music. Congratulations. See you in level seven.